Hello, my name is Connor Smith, and welcome back to another episode of Data in the Wild, hosted by Data Meaning. Before we begin, don't forget to subscribe to the channel below and click the bell to turn on notifications to be the first to know every time we upload a new video. Today we're covering what is Alteryx. Let's get started. Alteryx is an analytic process automation tool. In many data processes, you have inputs, you have outputs. You have a whole bunch of steps in between. Alteryx serves as a tunnel between your inputs and your outputs, allows you to automate those in between steps. So whether that's prepping and blending your data, meaning filtering or removing columns or blending would be doing a VLOOKUP or joining data together from multiple different data tables. Or perhaps that means enriching your data using external data sources and doing those same type of VLOOKUPs. Or whether that's analyzing your data, searching for certain customers that meet certain criteria or summarizing and grouping your data together into fewer rows. Alteryx is able to help you do whatever you need to do. I'm going to talk about three portions of the Alteryx platform. One, Alteryx Designer. Two, Alteryx Server. And three, Alteryx Gallery. As well as how Alteryx Server and Alteryx Gallery relate to one another. Alteryx Designer is a desktop application that allows you to drag and drop tools to build workflows. As you put together your Alteryx workflows, you're not just building out your analytical process, you're also in a way documenting that process with a visual representation of what is going on. You'll see that here in just a moment. I'll start by dragging a file from File Explorer onto my canvas. Alteryx, as I mentioned, is a drag and drop software that allows you to quickly insert data from lots of different sources Today, I'll just use a simple Excel file. By dragging and dropping from File Explorer, it automatically adds a tool onto my canvas. It will prompt me for what sheet from that Excel file I'd like to use. In this case, I'll choose the data sheet. Press OK here. Now I have my first input added to my Alteryx canvas. I can press Run here to display that data. down below. I can then add a filter tool. Again, just dragging and dropping. I can filter for where my city equals Denver. Press run again to see the results. And see here I have 22 records, that's the results. Right before the filter tool, I only had 50. Now that I only have my 22 records, we'll output this file to a different Excel file. I'll just call it my output file, have to browse. I'll just call this output. Press save. It'll prompt me for the sheet name I'd like to use. I'll just name this sheet name data. Change this option. Overwrite. So I can run it multiple times. Press run here. I'll point out that this new 22 record data table now being outputted. Alteryx has outputted my data to the output XLSX file. This is Alteryx Designer. It's a drag and drop software that quickly allows you to analyze, filter, and transform your data. 
Let's move on to Alteryx Server and Alteryx Gallery. From Designer, I'm able to save my workflow and push it to my Alteryx Server. Alteryx Server allows me to run my workflow even when I do not have access to my work. Computer, I can log on on a mobile device or another computer and access the workflows for execution and that workflow will be processed on an external server machine. Alteryx Gallery relates to server as it is the user interface in which I am able to access and execute workflows on the server. You can see a workflow that I just uploaded and press run here and see how that workflow is executed. And see, not only am I able to execute and produce an output file, but I'm then able to download that output file onto my machine. Alteryx server also allows me to schedule workflows to run automatically. So even when I'm out of office, Alteryx server can execute making the results available even when I'm not. So while Alteryx can be used as a simple ETL software, extracting your data, transforming it, and loading it to your output, Alteryx really is so much more. That wraps up today's quick video on what is Alteryx. If you have any questions or suggestions for future videos, please comment below. Don't forget to subscribe to know when future videos are posted. Thank you for watching.